Welcome back. Now, with all of our busy lives, when was the last time you just had a night out with just the adults where you danced, laughed, smelt the roses? Oh, I can't and even. had some romance. I have no idea why. <laughs> but, well, put it on your calendar now because the Foothills Club of Tucson is giving you that night with the seventh annual Love on the Rocks event. Chrissy Fry and Jessica Celentano are here with all of the details. Thank you both so much for being here. Thank you. And thank you for the beautiful roses <laughs> oh, that you brought us. Absolutely. Love this. You guys are winning. <laughs> I love this. So, Jessica, let's start with you. Really tell us, what is the Foothills Club of Tucson? We are a local nonprofit made up of about 60 club members. We put on fundraising events. Uh, we have, they're fun, they're entertaining, they're lively, a little outrageous. <laughs> and all the money that we raise benefits children's organizations here in Southern Arizona. Do you have uh, some examples of some of the organizations that you guys have funded? Absolutely. Yeah. We have funded Nourish, Cascade Foundation, Integrative Touch for Kids. We are all about children's charities and we try to fund about 12 a year. So. Wow. Yeah. Incredible. So now we have the Love on the Rocks event coming up. So tell us, ladies, why this event? What's special about it? Well, it started seven years ago as a member-only party, so to speak, and uh, it just grew. It got a lot of attention because we, um, we threw out a lot of entertainment, dinner entertainment. We hired a band. We did a live auction. We did the raffle. Um, this year we have a magician coming. So we kind of made it into a comical uh, fundraiser, and it just gets a lot of hype. It's a great way to spend uh, Valentine's Day instead of going to a restaurant and having a limited menu and, you know, packing a house like packing in like sardines. <laughs> um, this is a great way to bring your partner, your friends, your best friends, some of your best clients. I'm bringing some clients this year. And uh, it's just a great way. The gift gives all year long. And um, it started because there was nothing really else going on in town on Valentine's, <laughs> right? Um, so uh, we took over the holiday and uh, the, the party has grown. We, uh, we can fit 200 people in the venue this year and we've already sold 175 tickets. Wow. Well, speaking of the venue, why did you choose this? Is it in part because you guys could get so many people in there? Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess we wanted to do something different, yeah. something that was a little bit more hip. Um, we want to support downtown. Um, and it's just, um, the venue is neat because it's a shabby chic warehouse, mm -hmm. and that speaks a lot to what's happening in Tucson. And, um, you know, we just like to be different. We just like to uh, have a lot of fun, and, um, you know, it's going to be great. It's oh, I love it. Yeah, I, I <laughs> can't only speak. 25 tickets left? Yes. yes. So how do we get the tickets? How much are they? What do we do? Yeah. <laughs> yes. You can go to the website, um, www.foothillsclubofTucson.org, <laughs> and uh, tickets are 150 each per person, and we do have VIP uh, tickets available. They're a little bit more expensive. They're $175 or $300 for a couple. And then we also have some sponsorship opportunities um, that are also available online. Now, are we supposed to get super doodled up? What should I wear? This is what I need to know. What am I wearing? <laughs> yeah, I think this is, the, this is the confusion this year is that it's in a warehouse, so to speak. But it's, um, again, shabby chic. Yeah. Um, dress like you're going to go out on a date for Valentine's Day. You know, have fun. The girls are always going to outdress the men. So, <laughs> you know, and, it, and we we are in Tucson, so it's always, you know, casual and flirty and and um, yeah, Great. just bring your smiles. Well, it takes um, some some wonderful people to make an event like this happen. Is that right? So we want to thank some people today. Some Absolutely. Sponsors. We have Fry Financial and um, Kay Watanabe at Property Partners uh, for being our sweetheart sponsors this year. Um, we have a lot of great members in the club. We have um, Ed Alexander and Keith Cooper and Bill Netherton um, with Bartenders Unlimited who have helped us out tremendously um, market the event and, and, and get the 175 <laughs> tickets sold. That's amazing. So we definitely need to get these tickets. They're running out. I, this is sure to be a sellout. But you know what? It is. When was the last time we all just took a night for ourselves? Go out, do something right. fun. And deep down inside, we're going to know this is all, like you said, the gift that keeps on giving because it's going to help the kids. That's right. So, ladies, I cannot thank you enough. And thank you again so much for this. Absolutely. It totally made my morning. Amazing. <laughs> now, the seventh annual Love on the Rocks Affair will take place February 13th at 6 p.m. at 242 South Park Avenue. For more details, call 834-1476 or visit foothillscluboftucson.org.